I had two belts and I wasn't the pound for pound king. What's up everybody, Henry Cejudo here. That's right, the Triple C, soon to become C4. We're gonna go over the pound for pound rankings. Robert Whitaker, extremely tricky, very gifted. His only kryptonite is Israel Adesanya. Very good, sneaky right hand to that kick. It makes Robert Whitaker extremely dangerous. Jamal Hill, athletic. Athletic, driven, you know, is he the best in the world at 205? Fighting Glover, I I'm just not too sure, but he has a world title. Max Holloway, a valiant fighter, extremely dangerous. I mean, Max Holloway will always be in the top 15. Dustin Poirier, uh, shoot, warrior. Sometimes I wonder if Dustin Poirier has Mexican blood in him. Cause he's got, he's got a toughness that a lot of people won't have. He's got grit. Yuri Prohoshka, very tricky, very unorthodox. He listens to his mind, his body, his spirit. He has a different, he just has a different aura to him that makes Yuri Prohoshka extremely dangerous. Brandon Moreno, a savage. He's tough, you know, great wrestling for not being a wrestler. You know, carries Mexico in his heart. You know, he's, he's doing it. Alex Pereira, a soldier, tough. You know, one dimensional, but really good at what he does. Charles Oliveira, uh, very good grappling, very tricky, very slick in his sense. He's a technical fighter that likes to brawl sometimes, that's what gets him in trouble. But what he's been able to do in mixed martial arts has been second to none. Kamaru Usman really understands level changes and really puts everything together. Maybe not the best at everything that he does, but he knows how to put it all together. Aljamain Sterling, Academy Award winner, hell of an actor. Um, he has great ability. He uses his ability to his, to his best assets until Triple C comes back. Israel Adesanya, one dimensional, but he's good at what he does. Great striking, good fakes and feints, um, and he's got power in his hands. Awesome kicks. Leon Edwards, Leon Rocky Edwards, I mean, um, never letting go of the dream and believing in what he believed in, waited for so long, and now he's champ. Islam Makachev, super good top control. His grappling is uh, just as good as Khabib's, and you know, he has somewhat okay striking but his grappling and his spirit is where, where he's at today. Alexander Volkanovsky, a tactician, uh, very technical, very tactical. You don't know who's gonna come out. I always look forward to watching Volkanovsky because he brings things to the table. I always tend to be surprised every time he does fight. John Jones, the greatest of all time. There's no discussion on GSP, on anybody else, but, but John Jones, extremely gifted, understands his gift, and very humble when he's being coached. Now one thing I will say about John Jones, is he's a better competitor than he is a fighter, and that's what makes John Jones a damn winner. Henry Cejudo, the greatest combat athlete of all time. You know, with my stature, with my ability of, of understanding and recognizing my gifts, uh, great technique, great tactics. I, I go back to what I said about John Jones. I'm a better competitor than I'm a fighter, a history maker, somebody that likes to challenge, somebody that likes to put pressure on themselves to really take it to the next level, somebody that's not afraid, a fearless human being.